All right, moving on to goal two. Uh, we got a head-to-head -head here, a three-lapper head-to-head. So we'll hire Eric, and we have to let's see, overtake the Pagani twelve times while uh, hitting the average speed of two ten or 130.5 mph and win. And Santos is going to be our opponent of choice for this head-to-head -head three lapper at Spa. That's a rather lengthy race, isn't it? Ah, that is a beautiful Pagani. But that's not what we're here for. We're not here to admire the Italian beauty of weather. We're here to win this race while we make 12 overtakes. So, but well, we cannot go too slow. We gotta try to get that average speed goal as well. I think 210. All right, so there's a. Uh, Overtake number two, and let's see, number three, all right, and can we get one more? Oh, that slowed down a little too much, it's difficult to gauge. All right, so we got four heading into Lecon, and we'll let Pagani pass me once again. Try to catch up, maybe we get one more before Brussels. There we go, five, and oh no, that was, uh, less than ideal <laughs> but uh, at least uh, we got three laps so I suppose the high lap count here uh, works in my favor and we'll take the inside for overtake number six and maybe squeeze one more in before we head into the stave lot seven and eight no not quite all right. All right. So we got seven overtakes. Uh, I think I might be able to catch up, uh, squeezing a couple more. Eight. All right. And I guess you have to get the first place, like overtake solidly. If it, like tiny teeter tottering does not really count. All right, so nine, and we're hitting about 200 kilometers per hour average speed for the first lap. Uh, losing a bit through the bus stop chicane. But that's all right. Um, 197, we got two more laps. And we only have um, three more overtakes to worry about. So once we complete those 12, uh, I should be able to go at C11's full speed right now. Uh, I'm not able to quite do that because I'm trying to do this. 10 and let's see, we squeeze one more and 11 and all right, that should be good enough. There we go, 12. All right, and then now it's, we can leave our friend in Pagani behind and uh, work on our Average speed, bringing it up above the target of 210 kph. Uh, Alright, so. Alright, getting 200. And, uh, our speed, top speed is as uh, we're hovering on 250 and hitting 300 now, which does help definitely with that average speed slowly creeping up. Brought it up to 203, lost a bit there, but we should be able to regain it back. Uh, Alright, 204, 205, alright, we're hitting 320 kilometers per hour, top speed, about there, and do I have enough to slow down without crashing? Alright, that helps. All right, so finishing the lap two, around 205 kph average speed. So that is a 
good improvement compared to lap one. Especially, well, I mean, that's kind of expected, right? Since we don't have to worry about the extra overtakes. So we don't have to go at a pace of uh, Zonda F. So, of course, C11 can go flat out through Eau Rouge, which is always very exhilarating feeling. Um, anytime you can do that with the, all these super fast cars, it's a lot of fun. Alright, so we're up to 209 now. So I think this is looking promising, I'm gonna say it cautiously, because the we do have to bank up a bit more on the above 210 because you know the final bit once again we'll be losing a bit of speed because of the of course the bus stop chicane does slow us down quite a bit. So alright, so hitting 210 and just a little lost a little bit heading into once again state block which helps us this is the fastest section of the track so we really need this section to be clean and very fast so let's see all right 210 11 I keep building building all right the uh, top speed 300 and plus we got it up to 213 and change we'll cut across a little bit because I don't know <laughs> but uh, yeah I think we got enough there we go uh, with a little bit of speed to spare all right so five minutes and 55 cents and change 55 cents I meant 55 seconds <laughs> shows you where my mind is so That was a rather lengthy race, especially considering it was just a head-to-head. -head. Nearly six minutes. Uh, obviously, it didn't have to take that long, but because at the earlier part of the race, I had to do those overtakes. So I had to go at a Zonda F pace. Anyway, uh, that'll do for goal two. Uh, looks great out there. Awesome to see the C11 riding alongside its kids.